All right, YouTube, so uh, this truck is kind of an in-progress build. He's been here twice now and um, has plans for several more visits. Kind of a funny story. Uh, this guy kind of started this thing off by buying the uh, white tubular bumper that came on my white Roto Runner when I bought it out of Texas. And uh, this guy was just kind of getting his feet wet with this hobby and bought that bumper for cheap, threw it on here, and then later got bitten by the bug and realized he wanted something custom and wanted to start doing a build. And long story short, we took that bumper off and built him one. So let's get to it. So this bumper is basically a copy of the bumper I did on a 454 Rado Runner. Never really gave that truck a proper name. I just keep calling it that. Um, it is going to have a 20 inch light bar inside here and more than likely uh, five LP6s, all Baja Designs lights across the top, basically just like uh, my white truck. Um, we did the core support mod on here, um, which gets rid of that big unsightly factory bracket. Uh, we cut all the sheet metal from under the lights. This glass is ADV. And uh, actually it was a really good fit. This was a pretty smooth installation. I'm actually kind of surprised that uh, this is stock track width suspension. I mean, he's got Dirt King upper control arms and uh, King coilovers to uh, give it a couple more inches of ride height than obviously better riding performance off-road. Truck is four wheel drive, but just saying that Track width wise, with these fenders, this is something to note for you guys out there that might want to run glass and have clearance for 35s. Could um, definitely put 37s in here with some more trimming on the firewall. We did have to kind of cut back in here a little bit for turning. That this glass with this combo looks good. Uh, he does eventually plan on going to long travel, so that will bring out the tires more um let's see rear this truck we did a couple months ago um this is a missoula off-road bumper um you can tell he never got it powder coated so it's starting to rust but uh easy enough drop that off the powder cutter they'll blast it and i'll uh, get that thing color matched does have one of our hitches he's already got uh, some off-road trips on this thing so everything's all dirty I even saw some some videos and some stories of him out smashing around with this already so hitches you know kind of semi-hidden uh, did a dovetail cut for him for that uh, departure angle we've talked about on previous videos has of course one of our tire cages this is the uh, regular Bravo cage, Pro Eagle Jack. Um, I want to say that's about it on this truck. This thing does have a motor in it, cam. I assume long tubes or something, but it's uh, from Rackison. Those guys do a great job over there. So yeah, pretty cool uh, build going on little by little for this guy, Connor. Can't wait to uh, get to the next set for him. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. Could you please like it and subscribe to our channel? See you later.